Now it's time for some serious science. It's gonna be awesome. Grace's Science Place. Hello, welcome to Grace's Science Place. Today we're gonna make balloon rockets. It's gonna be awesome. This is a very easy experiment. All you need for this experiment is a balloon, some string, scissors, a straw, and tape. I just blew up a balloon! <laughs> Long ago there was a scientist named Isaac Newton. He discovered that. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. <laughs> this is called Newton's third law of motion. Rockets move because of Newton's third law of motion. My finger the rocket. <laughs> Rockets have gases that rush out and expand behind them. And this action creates an equal and opposite reaction, which is the thrust and rocket moving. This is my friend Rocky the Rocket. Stop Rocky! See the hot gases shooting out the back? That's the action! The reaction is Rocky moving up. Bye bye Rocky! Even this balloon rocket we're going to build Moves because of Newton's third law of motion. <laughs> First, cut a long piece of string. There! Next, put the string through the straw. Got it through the other side? Yes! Next, you have to find two chairs to tie these two. First, we tie the string to the chair. Now tie the other end to another chair. Next, you have to blow up your balloon. Phew! I just bent the tape. the back. The balloon reacts by moving forward. <laughs> Thanks for watching Grace's Sides Place. Hit the thumbs up below. Subscribe to my channel. So you can see all my fun videos. Remember kids, science is fun! Rawr, are you a Tyrannosaurus Rex? And the last. Rockets move. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh.